Let's see how to fix the Netflix error code TVQ ST137. Are you frustrated by encountering the Netflix error code TVQ ST137 while trying to enjoy your favorite shows and movies? The full error message says the Netflix has encountered an error retrying in 58 seconds. Code TVQ ST137. This common error can be disruptive, but we are not. In this particular video, we'll see some of the effective solutions to fix this particular error. So let's see how to fix the Netflix error code TVQ ST137. The first method is sign out and sign in. Try signing out your Netflix account and then signing back in. This can refresh your account information and may help you to resolve the error. Open the Netflix app on your device and or visit the Netflix website. Navigate to the profile section or the account settings. Look for the option sign out or log out sec select it. Confirm the action if prompted. For sign in, open the Netflix app or Netflix website. Select the sign in or login option. Enter the registered email address and the password associated with your Netflix account. Click or tap the sign in or login button to access your account. The second method is Check your network connection. Make sure that you have a proper internet connection with very good speed and a very good bandwidth. If you are having a poor internet connection, try to reset your router or the modem that will fix any kind of bugs or the glitches present in your internet connection. But still, if you are facing the issue, you can contact the internet service provider for further assistance. They are the expertise. They will help you to fix the problem and they will give you the better solution. The third method is restart your device. By restarting your device, you may be able to solve the error. This is the simplest fix you can try. Smartphone or the tablet, press and hold the power button until the power menu off menu appears. Select restart or reboot from the menu. Wait for your device to power down and restart. For computer, go to the Windows icon. Or the Apple icon in the bottom left or the top left corner of the screen, select power icon and choose restart from the menu options. So for smart TV or TV streaming, streaming device, locate the power button on the device or the remote control. Press the power button to turn off the device and wait for a few minutes before turning it back on. The fourth method is change the DNS domain name system for the computer. Changing the domain name system settings aims to address the potential network issues caused by the different DNS settings server such as DNS, Google DNS, Open DNS, which can provide the most stable connection, connection to the network service. Okay, for Windows, go to the control panel, search for the Windows search bar, network and sharing, then select change adapter settings on the left hand menu. Right click on the active network connection and choose properties and select IPv4 TCP slash IPv4 from the list of and then click properties. Choose the option use the following DNS server address. Enter the preferred and alternate DNS server address provided by your DNS service provider or the public DNS service such as Google DNS or the open DNS. Finally, you can click on OK to save the changes. If you are using the Apple or the Mac, go to the Apple menu and select System Preferences. Choose Network from the Preferences window. Select your active network connection from the left hand sidebar and then click on Advanced button. Navigate to the DNS tab. Click on the plus button to add the new DNS server and enter the preferred and alternate DNS server address. Click OK to save the changes. The fifth method is flush the DNS for the computer. Flushing the DNS caches for the computer can help you to ensure the DNS resolver cache is cleared, potentially resolving the DNS related issues that may contribute to the error code TVQST137. For Windows, open the command prompt as an administrator. You can go to this by searching the command prompt in the Windows search bar and right click on it. Selecting the run as administrator in the command prompt window, type the following command and press the enter. IP config slash plus DNS. Once the command is executed, you should see the message indicating the DNS reservoir caches was 
successfully flushed. Follow similar methods for the Mac or the Apple. The sixth method is contact the Netflix support team. If you have tried all other troubleshooting methods and if you are still facing the problem, you can contact the Netflix support team for further assistance. They have the expertise, they will help you to fix the problem and they will give you the better solution. Okay, so that's all about this. Thank you.